Thank you so much for receiving IG in Brazil here. You're very welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, so I'm very excited to talk about you to you about the news that you just shared with us. Uh, so Mortal Kombat 1 brought big news around Quan Chi's story. So I would like to know how did you decide to bring new aspects to his past and what can players expect from his mechanics and skills in the game? Quan Chi was is featured in the Mortal Kombat 1 story. We have a bit of a, of a Deadly Alliance reunion with him and, and Shang Tsung. And a, a, a lot of what we were doing with Mortal Kombat 1 has some references to Mortal Kombat, um, Deadly Alliance, Deception, Armageddon. And, um, but we really wanted to make him different um, than, than he is in the story. So it's, everything is based on sorcery. So he's kicking into portals, and then you know his leg comes out of another portal, and, and or these um, like these uh, kind of arms, these tentacles, almost like an octopus uh, coming out of portals. So everything he's doing is magic based. It's sorcery. He's not like a real brawler uh, per se, but um, that's what we really wanted him to feel like. Is is like how would a sorcerer fight kind of yeah Camilla is coming too so yes. i would like to know what can players expect uh when asking her help as a cameo fighter yeah um chameleon is similar to how we had in, in mortal kombat trilogy chameleon is basically a merger of katana melina and jade yeah. so she has three different modes where she can do katana moves she can do jade moves and and um and she could do uh, melina moves so um, you switch between them, and um, it, it, between the three of them, you have a, a crazy amount of moves for a cameo character, you know? So, um, Chameleon is one of those characters that we haven't seen in a long time, so we really wanted to make her special. And everybody loves Katana, Melina, and Jade, so I <laughs> really wanted to kind of a fan service for them. So, MK, in talking about the, the cameo fighters, uh, MK1 was released a few months ago. I, I would like to know how do you see the result of adding uh, the cameo fighters in the game, and how do you see the, this feature in the, um, the future of the franchise? We're very happy with um, how uh, players have embraced the idea of a cameo fighter. And a, a lot of players, like we wanted, are basically, instead of talking about which character is good, they talk about which pairs are good. Mm -hmm. So they'll say something, you know, along the lines of Scorpion and, um, and Tremor. Or, or you know, Sub Zero and Frost, or something like that. And so it's, I think it makes the game that much more um, unpredictable, more interesting, more a lot more, a lot deeper. Mm -hmm. um, so we're very happy with how players have really embraced the idea of cameo fighters. The controversial Peacemaker is finally arriving too. Yeah, yeah. I would like to know how did you decide to bring this character to the franchise, and what players can expect from him. You know, Peacemaker and, and Omni-Man and, and Homelander, uh, just believe it or not, coincidentally, they were, they kind of all fit into the kind of, you know, bad superhero yeah. uh, kind of uh, <laughs> category. And and that was by accident. We really weren't trying to, to think of it. But when we, when we thought of Peacemaker, we were all big fans of the Suicide yeah. Squad and the Peacemaker show and all that stuff. So um, we really wanted to have him in. And um, because, um, you know, John Cena was very cooperative and, mm -hmm. and, and enthusiastic in the, in the, in the studio. So um, we're, we're thrilled with how he turned out. And to finish, Ed, you have been to Brazil for so many times. Yeah. And to me, anyone from another country that comes to Brazil more than two times is already an honorary oh, Brazilian. Yeah. Yeah. Well, <laughs> I would like to know, how do you feel when you enter a meeting and someone says, Ed, we're going to Brazil again? <laughs> oh, I say, when do we leave? You know, I always, I, I love coming here. Uh, it's, it's, um, it's, uh, there, there's so much energy and so much, you know, I, I'm, I'm almost reminded every time um, of how, how much Brazilians love and remember and appreciate Mortal Kombat. So um, it's, it's always great. It's, it energizes us, you know, mm -hmm. just to, to do more.